So you call yourself a writer, but you don't believe in God. What sort of a writer doesn't believe in God? Roswell happened. Whitley Stryber was abducted by aliens. Whitley Stryber is the result of a drugs program. When you're an atheist, you exist. That's it. The UFO phenomena is a way for the government to control you. I'm an atheist. Don't believe your priest. And we don't need to believe in Jesus. En genre. What en genre? En genre. En genre. En genre. You know? In genre. You have to believe that there's a God to write horror. You have to believe that there's Satan to write horror. You have to believe in the power of the undead to write horror. You've been trained to want to meet aliens. If you don't believe in God, then you have no material for all your books. How can you be an atheist horror writer? Do you like my teeth? They're the teeth of an atheist, not the teeth of a Satanist. I had them filed down by a specialist. <laughs> I don't believe in God, and I don't believe in the fucking devil. The atheist manifesto is you live once, then you die. What is life? I live once, then I die. There is no afterlife. I am so sad. Basically, if you're not one of the clergy of the Church of Atheism, as ironic as that sounds, you're going to die a terrible death at the hands of the people who are using religion to rule you, to make you pay.